yeah, I'm just gonna move this to the side for now. <laughs> you can see that I've uh, changed the lighting. I'm, uh, I'm using the lights that came with my green screen. I'm not using uh, my lamp anymore. I'm using some lights. Good morning, guys. Nope. Sorry. Good afternoon, guys. <laughs> You're watching Psychotic Projects. This is uh, Toothpick 747, Episode 4. Um, and today we are working on the wings and the tail f and the and the tail fins. But anyways, I think we're mainly working on the wings today. We might work on the tail and tail fin uh, next episode, uh, just depending on how far we get. Before I get started, I just want to say that uh, there are a few issues that might come out. Um, for example, I'm actually gonna need this back. This is about three and a half uh, inches across. And the wingspan is just a little bit less than 30 and a half inches. So um, this right here is not the lightest thing in the world. And so putting something on it that's almost the same weight um, might be a little tricky. Uh, we'll see how we're going to work that out. Um, and also adding engines is going to be interesting too because... Well, I don't know how heavy those will be, but those will be pretty big, too. Um, I know that the tail and the tail fins, I'm probably going to do a double layer uh, just to make it thicker. Um, not a, It's not about strength. It's just for thickness. Okay, so that's looking a little bit better. I uh, did my, I put up my second uh, light. The one problem is uh, that using my desk lamp... Uh, that took away the reflection on here so now you can kind of see the reflection of some of the stuff up on my wall so I might have to take off this plastic thing alright so let's get started uh, I'm just gonna start doing this outline right there Okay, so I just finished the first wing. Uh, I might have seen the time lapse. Um, and I'm just going to be taking the off this off real quick. I've already kind of started. There are so many strings on this. Look look at that. Okay. Uh, I think that's good. Yes, yeah, so that's the bottom side. Uh, there aren't too many of these leftover paper pieces. Oh, that's a little weak. I'm going to put some... Oh, it's still bendy. Okay, so this one's kind of weak, actually. Let's move this off to the side. Okay. Let's see if we can find any weak spots, okay? Okay, so I'm going to have to start editing my videos real quickly because uh, my phone is running out of storage, so I'm going to have to start editing it so I can get those videos off my phone. Um, but real quickly, I think all the weak points, uh, have been glued together, um, so that's good. Um, right now, I am putting the supports on, like I did on the main level. I think I did one per inch, or one, one every inch, that seemed good to me. <laughs> uh, also, while I was, uh, making this, I used up all my, uh, cut toothpicks so I'm gonna have to cut a ton up and I also realized that these right here are a bit off cuz you can see that these columns right here are right here that are lower than the whole floor and so that's what I need to do with the wing is I need to actually make these lower than this right here so I'm gonna have to redo those let's hope the <laughs> the structure stays strong while I do that I've had a bit of uh, an idea um, I feel like I've been uh, getting a lot less done. I remember when I first started this project, I was able to get the outline, uh, the side view of the Boeing, and I was able to get this whole thing done in about like two or three days. And now the videos, they're like taking me like a little bit longer, so I think I'm gonna, uh, do less time lapses because, um, they take longer to set up, you know, and, I have to put the camera in position where it's kind of uh, uncomfortable for me to sit and so I have to work in a different, I guess, orientation than I normally would and so it's causing me to 
uh, not work quite as fast. So, um, less time lapses, and I'll probably just do more checkpoints, let you know what's happening. Um, and so that'll get that'll mean I get more done in each episode, and I also work faster uh, in each episode. So that's what I'm going to start doing from now on. Okay, so here is the wing with the supports. Um, there we go. It looks a little odd, uh, but that's because of uh, this uh, little flat piece right there. But if we put it where it's supposed to be on the plane, which is right about there, that looks pretty good. We got the tip. This is the front of the plane right here, and this is the back of the plane. So, yeah, it looks really good. Uh, so I'm really excited to, I'm probably going to uh, glue it on there. Um, okay, so on this first level that you can see that these are all kind of jagged. You know, they're not in rows, and that's uh, what I'm, I'm probably going to, on the wing, I'm actually probably going to do like rows that it's like all, it'd be like that. And then I cut this extra offset. They'd all be the same length, and then you just go row by row. That's probably what I'm gonna do for the wing. It uh, it looks a little bit better, and probably on the shell of uh the plane, I'm probably gonna do rows like that too. So, uh, yep. So I'm just gonna cover this whole thing like I did with the uh, the floor, and uh, I'll show you that when I've done that. All right. So just to finish up, I got this first layer on here. The reason it's a little jagged is because of this right here. Okay, so you can kind of see that this little bar right here is getting in the way of these toothpicks. So I'm probably going to have to remove this and just move it down the line a little bit. Um, what I did to cut these to the smaller size, because some of these were longer and some of them were shorter, is I wasn't able to use these wire cutters because, well, they're not very flexible. And also, I can only cut a maximum two at a time. So instead, I use these wonderful things, and they're nail clippers. And in case you're wondering, these these are my actual nail clippers. So, you know, don't be like, hey, you're using <laughs> you're using one to cut your nails and one to cut wood with. <laughs> Anyways, uh, yep. So that's that, and I think that's it for this episode. Um. We've gotten a lot done, <laughs> somehow. Uh, <laughs> I've been working on it for like two weeks, so I've been a little busy. Anyways, so I'm going to have to glue that. But anyways, this has been Psychotic Projects. Thank you for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe to stay updated with the rest of this project, and I will see you later.